hey guys so i just thought i'd do a quick haul of everything i've bought so far um as you know i've just moved into a new property so i'm gonna go slowly through everything this is basically just the adhesive for the doors i'm gonna put on and um, i bought a guest bed this from argos it was like 100 pound and it's okay it, it does the job it's not hard or anything it's quite comfortable and i bought this really cool steamer let me show you guys properly. It's so good. Stuff like this excites me. <laughs> um, it basically mops the floor and it dries instantly, but it does it like on heat. So it's really, really good. And I've got the paint that I'm gonna use to paint the wall. It's soft stone from Dulux. Can't wait to do that. I'll film myself doing that and show you guys. I've got a toolbox, which has literally all your basic tool stuff that you need. Trust me, it's really, really handy. Let me just show you guys. From um, b and it costs like 20 pounds. So yeah, it literally just has everything you need for basics, which is really, really handy. Then, the other thing I bought is this Hoover, which I love, it's so flexible. This is um, by the brand shop and the guy who sold it to me sold it well, he's a good salesman. But yeah, it's really good, I tested it yesterday. And it really sucks up a lot. And then you can change this filter right here. Um, and it's really flexible, you can go into like really tight spaces, you can like undo the parts and go really, like I, I was able to reach the ceiling with it, so it's really good. And I've got this beautiful kettle, I haven't opened it yet, from Curry's. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. I only got it because I like the way it looked, to be honest with you. I don't really drink tea or anything like that. But you know, you always need a kettle, so I got that. And I also got this printer by Canon. Because you know, it's just always handy to have a printer. So I got this from Curry's also. Yeah. Then, this is the flooring that I'll be using. It's all marble, guys. Ages, ages to bring this up, like two or three hours. Do you know how heavy this is? And it wouldn't fit in the lift, so you have to bring it up one by one. Oh my gosh. And then these are just some beddings I've got. I've got two pillows and also a duvet from Pound Stretcher. And I spent like 10 pounds on everything bought and built this cabinet yesterday and I really like it it's just cute and simple I'll show you and I'm basically using it to hold all my cleaning products so yeah it's really useful I'm gonna buy more stuff today and then here we have a lot of work going on so I'm gonna change the floor in now So this is what it's looking like right now. And this is the floor that I'm using, the tiles that I'm using, but they're turned around right now. So yeah, a lot going on. And this is the man who's doing all the brilliant work, Tinde. Say hello, Tinde. <laughs> he's really good at what he does, and yeah, he's doing everything. So you'll see a lot of him. Yeah, so I will touch back soon. So this is the finished result of moving the flooring. As you can see, everything is just out. Oh, this is the floor I'm putting in, by the way. It's gonna look so nice. Yeah, so literally all the flooring is out. Um, everything is everywhere. <laughs> these stains in the walls. So we've put the same flooring down in this room, which is almost finished. It's looking good. As you can see. It's just this back here. This thing I've got is this um, wine glass. It comes as a pair, two white wine glasses. And we'll see what I'm going to do with it. I'm actually going to use this in the bathroom. So you'll see what I'm going to do. So this is the first thing I got from Danelle. I mean, sorry, from Home Sense. What I got was this toilet brush. 
and the toilet brush holder. So this is a toilet brush holder like this, like stone, and I really like it. And then this is the toilet brush right here. So that's how it looks. And it cost $16.99. Um, the wine glasses cost $5.99 by the way. But yeah, so that's that. And the next thing I got was this like soap dish thing which um, I'm gonna put like pretty like spa soaps on but I didn't manage to find any today so I really like the wood effect which will match my bathroom and then the silver here this was $6.99 and the bottom of it also has like a really um, durable material that can just attach to the surface as well so yeah I really like that next thing I got was this suction shower basket and you can put so wash your bath and you can put like your sponge your soap whatever in it and I don't need to like build anything because it's a suction thing so it will just stick on I'm hoping so yeah um this was I don't know oh yeah, 7 99 so yeah that would be really really useful because I never like to not being able to put my stuff down somewhere so this will be useful for that then the next thing I got is this bath and shower gel I literally got it because it will look nice and it goes with the bathroom but it's a bath and shower gel lemongrass and mandarin 100 millimeters and I like the wood effects and the the um, lid as well I have no idea what it smells like actually let me smell it quickly Hmm, sounds decent. Uh, this was $5.99, so if I guess you need to use it, it's right there. And the last thing I got was this brown basket. And I'm going to basically just put all my tissues in here because I buy lots of tissue at Wongo. So I'm just going to put all my tissue paper, toilet roll, sorry, in here. I just think it's really nice. Again, it matches the whole wood effect that I'm going for. And it was £15. $14.99. Um, let me see if there's anything else. Okay, and then I've got these um, a soap dispenser and a matching, um, what do you call this thing? Toothbrush holder and toothpaste holder, which I really, really like. I just like the kind of diamond effect on it, and it's like a stone graphite material again. So, like, my guest bathroom has like really earthy tones and moods, so I was just kind of trying to match that since I'm not really changing the decor, so I decided to follow the decor of that sense. So, yeah, this is cute, and that's all I got from Home Sense. Next up is the Melm, really popular thing I got. It's just like a jar. Um, I guess you meant to put plants or whatever in it, but I'm going to use it to put the stuff that I bought. I don't know what it's called, but I'll show you it. Um, and it has like, the, again, this stone, stone earthy kind of effect. And it's grey, which I really like. And that's how it looks. It's cute, or whatever. And this was, um, these ones don't have the prices on them, actually. Okay, I think it was around £15, so yeah. And then I've got this, do you know what I realised after I got it that it's actually a laundry basket, not a bin. But I really liked it for a bin, so I bought it and it's only £5. Pounds. It's really cute. I like the basket effects that it has, but it's actually plastic. And then I've got, I love these room diffusers, they smell so nice. This one's going to be for my ensuite bathroom. Um, it's red berry and it was £8. Pounds. So I wish you guys could smell it. It's not even open and I can smell it, it smells so nice. Okay, let me just say, I'm a fake flower type of girl. Um, I just, I picked up, initially I picked up a bunch of flowers myself, and then I saw this, and I was like, okay, no, this is what I'm gonna get. I think it was seven or eight pounds, and it comes with the base, it's just cute. Um, I got the, I made this cupboard thing, which I'll show you guys, and I'm just gonna place it on top of that. I think it's so nice, it's just cute. So yeah. Next, I got these two sponges. Again, if anyone comes around and they need to use a sponge, I got sprays, lovely. And I got some from Savers pack for my pack, which I'll show you guys when I'm doing the Savers bit. So yeah, I got those. Oh no, it broke. It broke. 
but it's okay because I can just face it this way so no one will notice. Okay, this, I don't know what it is, I just thought it looked nice and it will look good in the bathroom. So I bought it. I think it was seven pounds or so, it's just a cute ornament. I'm not an ornament type of girl, but I just think it will go with the whole theme of the bathroom. It's like a marbly um, texture and it reminds me of maybe leaves or I don't know. But it's just got a nice structure to it, so it just creates different shapes and vibes in the bathroom. So yeah, that's that. Cute. And then I've got these two flake plants. Again, I'm a flake plant kind of girl. But I think they really, really brighten up the space and make them look nice. This one, I'm going to go get a plant pot for it because I don't like this one. Um, and I'm going to get it in Ikea maybe. And as you can see, it was 6 I think it's really nice. And then I've got this one, and I really like the pot on this one actually, that's why I bought it. And I just like the combination of the leaves. So yeah, that's that. This was, I think it was £7. So yeah. Lastly, I've got this kind of cactusy one. Again, it's fake, but it's really cute. And it'll just be a cute addition to the room. And I think it was £6. So, I've got myself a bath mat, although I don't know if I like it, I just got it because the colour matches with the bathroom and because it was only £5. So, I'm not a fan of bath mats like this, but I guess it will do. If I really don't like it, I'll just buy a new one. So yeah, that's that. And then I've got this like basket to just store stuff in my vanity. So it'll look really cute. And that's what that looks like again it matches that this thing that walk so they're both the same so a bit of matchy matchy going on and i found these bargain towels are expensive you know so anyways i've got these two towels bath towels five pound each again for guests so everything is there if you need the guests five pounds each and they're four bath towels i'll show you so as you can see that's in half this is in half, so you already know that the full thing is long. So yeah, this, I don't know what these are called, but it just smells nice. And the flavour is papaya and coconut. Oh, it smells so nice. I love stuff that smells nice. So yeah, I bought it, and you'll see what I'll do with it. Not only does it smell nice, it looks nice. So I'm all about aesthetic, and it fit, fits the whole natural, earthy tones and theme I'm going for. Um, I also bought another diffuser, it's called Fresh, Fresh Blossom and it smells just like really fresh and earthy and flowery so again I think it just matches the theme of the bathroom so yeah that's what that looks like and it smells so nice I bought some mini candles so I don't know if I'll ever want to have a bubble bath I can just light these around the tub, I probably won't use these but they look cute and they smell nice actually so I might just leave them out because they actually smell really nice. Okay, then I bought a set. Do you know, I wasn't going to buy kitchen stuff, but I saw this and the aesthetic just matches me. And I was like, what if when I'm ready to buy kitchen stuff, it's not here? So I was like, no, I need to buy this. So I got a set of sugar, tea and coffee. I don't drink tea or coffee, but it matches the aesthetic and you always need to have one. You don't always need to, but yeah. So it's marble, obviously fake marble, and gold, which I love. And my kitchen's gonna have those colors, so it matches perfectly. So this is what the inside looks like. And I think these are seven pounds each. So this one's the sugar one. This is the coffee one. And this one is the tea one. So yeah, I love these. Okay, and that's that for Danelle. As you can see, I've got loads of stuff from there. So next up is Savers. <laughs> First I've got a couple of toothbrushes. Again, one for the guest bathroom and then the other for um, the ensuite bathroom. And Colgate Total toothpaste, again for the guest bathroom. These face flannels that I just came across, they were 99p each, and I just got and three because I thought I could just put it like this and again it matches the earthy colour theme tone of the guest bar so I'll just find somewhere to make this look cute. Another pack of sponges for one pound. If anybody needs them they're right here. 
I'll add some bin liners for 99p. I've got a pack of coconut face wipes, again for 99p, which I think is a steal, because there's two of them. And then I've got a pack of these, I think these are £59 and they're cotton pads, so if you need to take off your makeup, or yeah, that's it really, if you just need it for anything, they're there for you. And then I've also got body cream for my guests, you know, if they forget theirs, then they have it, it's coconut, no, it's coconut, yeah, I love anything coconut, I'm going to smell it actually. Mmm, that smells so nice. And then I've got shaving sticks if I don't know anyone has an emergency. <laughs> just there. I've got one of Dove or two of these again if my guests need bar soap. It's right there for them. And I also got these two face washes which are for me actually. These are the face washes I use. Um, St. Ives and Garnier. But I use these like once or twice a week um, because they're too harsh for my skin. So yeah. Also got my soda water for myself, um, and this is for the guests' mouthwash. So they literally have everything that they need. I got myself Vaseline, and that's that for the whole bag.